So, this is the land of the Kais. There's not much here, but it still kind of reminds me of Earth. The Z-Sword, right? Sounds pretty cool, but I wonder what it could be. This is the Z-Sword. Huh. Now please try to remove it. To the best of my knowledge, no one has been able to remove this blade. So, I just need to pull it out, huh? Sounds like something out of a storybook. So, uh, I'm supposed to pull out this Z-Sword, but then what happens? Legends say you will be imbued with immense power. Perhaps even enough power to destroy Majin Buu. What? <laughs> really? I guess that means this thing's pretty sharp. I'm kind of scared now. You can't remove the sword, so you have nothing to fear. Kibito, please be quiet. Gohan must concentrate. Please, Gohan, try to remove the sword. Huh. All right, here goes. <laughs> no use. It won't budge. Hmm. All right. Let's try this, then. Super Saiyan? Well, I doubt that'll change anything. <laughs> it's no use. Several Supreme Kais before you have tried, and also failed to remove the blade. Why would a mere mortal succeed? Ah! Mm! Look, he did it! I... I can't believe it! I'm just gonna cut straight to the chase, okay? Goten and Trunks are both fine. But Gohan and Vegeta? They were killed by Majin Buu. Huh? <laughs> Gigi! Vegeta! No! He can't! Listen to me, people of Earth! I am using magic to speak to all of you telepathically. Now close your eyes. I have something I'd like to show you. My name is Bobbity, and I am a terrified and powerful wizard. And this here is my loyal servant, the even more frightening Margin Boo. What is this? Are, are, are you seeing this too? Hey, what kind of freaky crap is this? I've run into a bit of trouble today, you see. And now I'm looking for three troublemakers. This one. This one. And this one. If I cannot find these three fools, <laughs> well, allow me to show you what will happen. All right, Martin Boo, do it! Hey! Uh, 
monster! What has he done? I will warn you one more time. You must tell me where those three are. If you do not, we will exterminate every last one of you five days from now. I eagerly await your reports. Damn that bug-eyed bastard. So those are the guys that killed Vegeta and Gohan. We can't let there be any more casualties. I'm going to confront them. No! Think about it. If you die on us, there won't be anyone to teach Goten and Trunks how to fuse! We have the Dragon Balls. We can use them to repair any damage done and bring back anybody that's been killed. You get it? <sighs> Fine. them focus on learning this new technique you got it let's get started everybody pay close attention all right time to learn how to fuse people of earth I've just received some very interesting information One of the three troublemakers I'm searching for, Trunks, supposedly lives at a place called Capsule Corporation in West City. I think we might head there next. For everyone's sake, he had better be there. I would show myself if I were you, Trunks. Your home won't be around much longer if you don't. My grandpa and grandma are still at the house! Goku! Did you hear that just now? My mom and dad are done for! And so is West City, for that matter! It'll be fine, Bulma. We'll bring them back with the Dragon Balls. You don't get it! If my lab gets destroyed, so does the Dragon Radar! The radar requires special parts that you can't just get anywhere! Which means, we won't be able to summon Shenron! What? That is a problem. Alright, Trunks, hurry back home and try to find the Dragon Radar. Okay, I'll try to stall Bobbity and Majin Buu as long as I can. Are you sure? Aren't you just gonna get your butt kicked? Hmm, I can distract them for at least a little bit. Anyway, hurry before they get to West City! Find those guys and fast. I hope I can buy trunks enough time. Found them. Yo, <laughs> it's you. Yeah, and I'm here to deliver a message. Listen up. The three people you're looking for are gonna show up sooner than you think. I can promise you that. Just wait a little longer. Don't destroy anything else or harm any more innocent people. Now why should we wait? Oh, you're up to something, aren't you? You bet we are. We're training to beat you guys. 
<laughs> Beat us, you say? No amount of training could ever make that possible. We're not going to just sit here and wait. You will bring them to us now! You know, I kind of had a feeling you were going to say something like that. Which means I don't really have a choice. Guess I'm going to have to make you wait then. <laughs> Fascinating. Very well then. Show us what you can do. Hey, Martin Boo! What are you doing? Hurry up and obliterate this fool! Okie dokie, Pokey! Come on! What's with that? Why is a strong guy like you taking orders from Bobbity? Hmm? Shut your mouth! I don't recall asking for your opinion! Martin Boo is my loyal servant. He obeys my every command. What is your problem? Do you want me to seal you up again? If you seal Boo, you did! That guy kill you! <sighs> Curse this creature! When did he start to think for himself? But don't worry! Boo kill him! Boo don't like goody goodies like him! <sighs> <laughs> Looks like it's do or die. That won't work! Vegeta tried the same thing, and look what happened to him! Good point. Then I guess I'd better kick it up a notch and go one step further. What do you think? What? This is a Super Saiyan. And this is a Super Saiyan level beyond that of Super Saiyan. Let's just call this... Super Saiyan 2. What a pathetic transformation! Nothing's different from the previous form! And this... This... is going even further! This... It's Super Saiyan 3! Sorry it took me so long. I'm still not used to this form just yet. You have scary face now! But Voodoo's scared! Uh, yes, yes, precisely, you fool. Now Margin Boo, destroy this ruffian! I haven't made a 
single dent in this guy. Hm. Trunks' energy is on the move. That means he must have found the Dragon Radar and is leaving West City. to hear that. Shame I don't have the time. I'm gonna be heading back now. Oh, we're not going to just let you get away. Crush him, Majin Buu! Don't forget what I said. The three you're looking for will show up soon, Bobbity, in two days. Do yourself a favor. Stay out of trouble and just wait a little longer. Stay strong? Those guys? <laughs> Do you really think I'm going to do as you say? This kind of stinks. I mean, I was really just beginning to enjoy my fight with Majin Buu. <laughs> he disappeared! Hey, he got away! This is your fault! You wasted too much time! Now go find him, you fool! What? A good idea? You can't speak now, can you? Now you know cast spell to seal Boo! <laughs> Boo learned a lot from you. But Boo no need you now! <laughs> Woohoo! Here we go. Now that Bobbity's gone, nothing's preventing Majin Buu from going on a rampage. What's wrong, Goku? What's wrong is that I'm officially beat. Who knew transforming into Super Saiyan 3 would do such a number on my body? Won't be long now. I don't have much time left here. So until then, we have to make sure the kids perfect that fusion technique. Those two are the last chance this planet has. I... I got it! This is the Dragon Radar, right? All right. Look, we really don't have much time left. So do yourselves a favor and get ready, you two. Yes, yes sir. sir! You're gonna need to be able to match one another's energy. But you can practice that later. First, we'll start with the hard part, so pay attention. For the fusion pose, you both have to mirror each other exactly. I'm gonna show you the pose now. So don't take your eyes off me, okay? First, you stand a little bit away from each other. Then, do this. Now, watch the angle of your arms. Phew! With your arms in opposite directions, you take three steps to get closer to each other. Jun? Then, you make fists with your hands. Watch the angle of your legs. Then, you bring your fingers together like this. And don't forget to extend your legs out really far like this, too. We have to do that? It's so lame. Yeah. To make things a little easier to follow, me and Piccolo are gonna model it for you, okay? What? Wait, we are? Just like this. 
You both have to move like you're each other's reflection in a mirror. Few. Jun. Ha! All right, your turn. One, two, one, two. Goku, it's about time we take you back to the other world. Yeah, I know. Piccolo, it's up to you. Right. Goku, see you around. Well, uh, not really, but you know what I mean. Goodbye, Goku. Come on, Chi Chi, don't look so sad. You still got Goten, right? But, but what if he's killed by Majin Buu too? Don't worry. Once he masters this technique, Majin Buu won't stand a chance against him. If I see Gohan on the other side, I'll be sure to tell him you said hi. Okay. <gasps> I... I get the feeling that Gohan is still alive. I hope you're right. I really do. Yeah. Goku, we really must be going now. Right. What is it, Goten? Uh, oh, I know. You want to give your dad a hug, don't you? Oh, is that what you want? Why didn't you tell me earlier? Goten, take good care of your mom. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. <sighs> Uh -oh. All right, everyone, I'm off. Look me up when you die. Man, I don't know how Goku can have such a carefree attitude, even about death. I trust that you can handle things on your own from here, yes? Right. Thanks, Granny. I wonder if Gohan's already made his way to Otherworld. Hmm? Huh? I don't believe it. Gohan! Yeah, that's his energy, all right. Uh, but how? Hmm, where is he? Wait, it's not King Kai's place. No. There! What the hell is this place? He's here. Gohan's here. I can sense his energy. Where could he be? He's close. Huh? Hey! Huh? Huh, Dad! Uh, what? What in the world are you wearing? What the? The Supreme Kai? A and that old-timer? Wait, didn't he die? Uh, Dad? What are you doing here? About that. I see. So Majin Buu's already caused that much damage.
So, that's the legendary sword you were talking about, I take it. That thing looks crazy sharp! You said it's the Z-Sword? Indeed. Let's test it out with some catch and tight. The hardest metal in the universe. Haha! <laughs> I bet this thing will cut through that stuff like a hot knife through butter! It's a legendary sword, right? Here goes! Yeah! It broke! This can't be! The, the Z-Sword! It... But it's... the ultimate sword! Well, Supreme Kai, you're the one who wanted to test it out on the hardest stuff around. But... but it was supposed to give its wielder the strongest power in the universe! <laughs> that shows how little you know, doesn't it? Huh? Wait... Who's the old guy? Who are you calling an old guy? I'm the Supreme Kai from 15 generations before you! <laughs> 15 generations before me? The... the Supreme Kai? Many ages ago, a truly evil individual feared my special ability so much that he sealed me in that sword that you just broke. He doesn't look like he's got any special abilities. Just looks like an old geezer to me. Uh, yeah. Well, I never. I guess I won't tell you what my special ability is then. What? Come on! I, I was just kidding! <laughs> I'm still not telling you. I'll get a real woman to kiss you if you promise to tell us. Doesn't that sound nice? Are you serious? You're not pulling my leg? Yeah, I'm totally serious. I knew it. He's the same type as Master Roshi. So then, would this power of yours be enough to defeat Majin Buu? Well, I can't say for certain, but yes, it should be. Listen up, Gohan. I can't go back to Earth anymore. I need you to get Bulma up to speed and ask her to cooperate. Uh... Wait... You want me to ask Bulma that? Look, we're saving the whole universe here. It's a good deal if you ask me. <sighs> Even if we do save the universe, Bulma's gonna kill us. Okay, wait. What kind of abilities are we talking about here? Right then. As for my special ability, I can release one's true power and raise it beyond its limits. <laughs> Never heard of an ability like that, have you? What? Seriously? That sounds like a pretty common ability, actually. Ah, how dare you! I said beyond one's limits! Far beyond! You there. You're the one who pulled the sword out, yes? Come here. Right then. Now just stand there and don't move a muscle. Uh, okay. And here we go. For the destruction of Majin Buu. <laughs> <laughs> Hey! Hey! Ahem! <clears throat> go! Go! <laughs> Yay! Yay! Um, how long is this gonna take? The ritual takes five hours, but the power increase takes twenty! Huh? Uh, I'm gonna take a nap then. Hang in there, Gohan! Oh, man. A day was about to elapse since training began. 
Very good, you two. You've more or less perfected it. Think it might be time to see if you can actually pull it off. All right. First, match each other's energy. Uh, okay. Good. Now begin. did it at least this time in at least 30 minutes we'll have you try it again as super saiyans <laughs> don't you think you're underestimating me i've got what it takes to beat majin buu right now you don't know the first thing about how strong majin buu is there's absolutely no way you can beat him not just yet, anyway! So can we trust a little punk like this? In just one single day, the feared Majin Buu... After turning some of his victims into clay, he constructed a house to come back to after his daily destruction. The people of Earth continued their fight for survival against the Majin menace and deployed their military forces. But that ultimately proved futile, with each force being completely decimated. Soon thereafter, humanity stopped trying. But hope was not completely lost among those remaining. They knew their savior was still alive somewhere and ready to spring into action. The man who overpowered Cell and became the world's, no, the universe's greatest warrior. That savior is none other than the legendary undefeated warrior, world martial arts champion, Mr. Satan. So that's Majin Buu's house, huh? Well, uh, I wonder if he's home. Uh, I hope he isn't. Oh, oh he's not here. <laughs> oh, what's the matter, Mozzie Boo? You chicken? Well, uh, that's that then. Uh, he's not here, uh, so I can't fight him. Uh, time to head back now. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Hello, uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Hmm. Why me turn you into this time? Wait, wait, wait a second, uh, Mr. Mazian Boo. You see, I've come to see if there's anything I can do for you. <laughs> you want to be Boo's servant? Uh, yeah, of course I do. I've actually uh, brought you a present, Mr. Mazian Boo. Here, it's some premium chocolate. Take it. Chocolate! What? It means it's very expensive and super delicious. Hmm? Please work. <laughs> he ate it. He actually ate it. <laughs> what an idiot. I put enough poison in that chocolate to kill an elephant. Chocolate tasty! Huh. <sighs> 
Huh? It's better than people chocolates! <laughs> oh, um, um. Uh, I see. You fun guy! Who made you servant? What? Oh, well, thank you very much. Why, you? Don't get too cocky, Fatso. I'm gonna pound you into big putty for this. And so began a strange friendship between Majin Buu and Mr. Satan, with Mr. Satan working tirelessly to keep Majin Buu's mood under control. Several days later... Well, welcome back! I'm still in the middle of preparing our meal! Well, what's that dog doing here? This guy knows scary 